Tell us why you've decided to reveal so much. Um, I decided to, to show everything. Um, there are many uh, books and videos about judo techniques and people sh showing stuff. And of course I did that um, uh, with this video. I wanted to show the range of techniques I used in my career and we have very nice examples of that. But I also wanted to speak about my preparation towards tournaments, yep. uh, study, uh, studying my opponents, uh, uh, the tension of a tournament, uh, the build up towards the, the big championships. Um, uh, I, I love techniques and I love to work on techniques. Um, but there's more in the life of a, a, a high-level player uh, which, uh, which determines uh, success or failure towards the big championships. You also talk about the sacrifices you've made and uh, certain things you've had to cut off in your life to focus on judo and you, you've revealed a lot there. Do you, do you feel that's important to get that message across? Uh, yeah, I wanted to tell about uh, the life uh, as a judo player at this level. Uh, which is not only on the judo mat, uh, but it's also outside the mat. It's you are um, preparing yourself uh, actually 24/7 uh, as a player towards the championships. So it's only a few hours uh, per day on the judo mat, and that's where we will see the nice techniques. But it's also uh, living as a, a high-level athlete and uh, rest and. Uh, uh, eat and make sure, sure what do you do, uh, what do you don't do. Uh, there are so many nice things I didn't do, uh, but I, uh, I got so much back in reward.